What's going on ladies and gentlemen, hope you guys are having a great day as usual. So for this video guys, I'm going to be reacting to a new Joe Coy stand-up clip. And the clip that I'm reacting to is Kids Have It Easy These Days. Now guys, this is from his new Netflix special. I haven't seen anything from Joe Coy in a minute, so hit the like button because it helps the channel and the video grow a lot. But enough talking, let's jump into the clip. We'll have a little discussion after. Let's go. That's the cool thing about this generation. They got everything. They got everything they need. I have to worry about the shit that we had to go through. Fuck. I got it good. I felt sorry for my mom. Like, I don't know how my mom did it. I got all the tools to keep an eye on my son. I wish, if my mom had it, oh my God. <laughs> like, if I, if, if I didn't come home and my mom told me to come home, she'd go crazy. Be home at 10. Please, Joseph, come home at 10. 11.30. Oh my God. <laughs> Oh my God, where are you? He's, someone kidnapped Joseph again. Someone kidnapped Joseph again, which means I was kidnapped before. I was never kidnapped. <laughs> my son, find my son out. Boop. I press the button. Boop. If he doesn't return my text, yeah, I text him five times. Hey, where are you? Doesn't return. Hey, answer your phone. Doesn't return. Hey, man, where are you? Just press the Find My Son app and a little emoji of my son is in front of 7-Eleven like this. <laughs> and I can go to sleep. The shit these kids have are amazing. And you got to tell them how good they got it. To download a movie in less than five minutes. Less than that. A minute. 4K. They can watch a movie. You got to tell them how hard we had it. What we had to do for the new movie. New release Tuesdays at Blockbuster Video. <laughs> where they promised you a hundred copies of Jurassic Park. And you got there early and you ran up to that display wall and you flipped every cover and it says out of stock, out of stock, out of stock, out of stock. Fuck! Then you ran up to the counter, did anyone return Jurassic Park? And then he goes, no, but we have some coming in in two hours. I'll wait. And you fucking stood there by the counter and you looked out that window where the return drop was like a nerd just scouting. Then you see people dropping covers in, and you try and read it real fast. You saw one go in, it had a letter J and a U, like, oh, sh I think that was, sir, I think you just dropped Jurassic Park. I saw a J and a U. I'm pretty sure that was Jurassic Park. I've been here four hours, please. And the guy's like, here you go, buddy. There you go. And you're like, thank you so much. Yes. And then you look at him like, Jumanji, I don't want this. You know, Yo. I, I drink bottle. I, I drink this water, bottled water, and it started 9.5 pH is the one that was like the one that was sold to me by my son. This is this generation. This is how good they got it, right? I'm paying like five dollars a bottle. What the fuck am I doing? <laughs> because one day my son came home from school. It was like the fourth grade. I don't know what grade. It was really young. He was really young, and he came back with a note from the teacher, and it said, "Can you please back bottled waters?" for your son. Three bottles, if you don't mind, because we're shutting off the water fountains. I was like, what? They said, preferably 9.5 pH. Give them healthier water. I was like, Joe, what is this 9.5 pH water? He said, oh, they want us to drink 9.5 pH water. It's healthier water for us. It's really healthy. What does pH stand for, Joe? He goes, perfect hydration. I go, what? <laughs> like, this fucker doesn't even know what it is. We both don't know. I go, why are they turning off the water fountains? Joe, what is this all about? He goes, oh, there's, uh, there's fluoride in the water, and, uh, and it's not good for you. So they're shutting off all the water fountains uh, because there's fluoride in the water. I go, Joe, you don't brush your teeth. <laughs> you should drink all of that water. <laughs> fluoride in the water. They're turning off all the water fountains at the school. Shut them off! I had to buy, I had to start buying bottled waters for these kids. What the fuck? We drank all that water fountain. I think I came out all right. I think. I think a lot of us did. We enjoyed water fountain moment. You remember that? That minute that when each class had to come out 
Each class got to come out and they'd line up single file line in front of that water fountain and each kid got 10 seconds to drink as much water as he could. <laughs> and all the other kids would count. One, one, thousand. Two, one, thousand. Two, one, thousand. Four, one, thousand. And that kid's fucking... Four, one, thousand. Five, one, thousand. Six, one, thousand. Seven, one, thousand. Eight, one, thousand. That fucking kid was struggling. Because the plumber that installed the water fountain put the water pressure so low. It was barely dribbling over that nipple. And you just suck it in liquor. How healthy was that shit? Liquor. Suck it. And what was that green, crusty shit? What the fuck was that? COVID-14? Yo! These kids don't even know what a hose is! They don't know what a hose is! That was our bottle of water! You rode around for five hours, you looked at your friend, you guys thirsty? Yeah! <laughs> and you pulled up to any house! Random any house, house with yeah. the hose in the front lawn that was communal! Anyone got to use that shit! Public <laughs> yeah, property! Man. And you yeah. ran, we fucking ran! We all ran. Who we get the hose first? I got it first. That kid thought he won, but he didn't, because he has no idea that there's water in the middle of the hose that boiled up to 450 degrees. <laughs> now he's about to get a mouthful of lava. Turn it on. <laughs> <laughs> These kids don't even know what a hose is. They don't know what a hose is! I asked my son the other day, I go, Joe, do you know what a hose is? He's like, those bitches at the club, Dad, I'm like, Joe. <laughs> Yo! All right, guys, great stuff there by Joe Coy. As usual, it's been a while. It's been a long time since I watched Joe Coy. Joe Coy. Um, I'm happy that he has a new special out. I'm gonna start watching a lot more of these clips, guys. Just great stuff overall. I was born in 1990, so I pretty much became conscious at the later parts of the 90s, like 96, 97, 98, 99. And then I grew up pretty much throughout the, the 2000s, so I could kind of relate to what he's talking about, like going to the video store, um, drinking out of ho uh, hoses with your friends, um, just interacting differently. Like the world was way differently in the 90s and the, the 2000s than it is now. It's not a bad thing. Um, I'm not knocking the next generation. They have all these devices and stuff, but if I was young and I was growing up at this time, I would be using them as well. So it's not a, a which is better or making fun of one and, and saying the other one's better. It's just things are different than they were 20 or 30 years ago. And it's cool. It's cool to look back and laugh at it and kind of laugh at where we are now. So that's the way I see it. Let me know what you guys think in the comment section. Hit the like button if you enjoyed the video because it helps the channel and the video grow a lot. But I'm going to wrap it up. So take care of yourself. Stay safe because it is a crazy world and there are a lot of crazy people. But most importantly, guys, you already know by now. Peace.